Uh, okay, why isn't this put him into battle mode? Aha, uh -huh, okay, there we go. First thing we're going to want to make sure is that our weapon is fully done. Uh, that's a steel weapon, never mind. Just make them both, just for good cause or whatnot. Um, portions, we need vampire oil. And let's go kick some ass. Okay, now we can kick some ass. Why is she invisible? Not good. Okay, there we go. Um, uh oh. Come on, where are you at? There she is. Come on, we need your little scream. There you go. Okay, last attack next time, maybe? That attack work, okay, there we go. Then. Come on, look at the hell. A chicken game. And you did. Sucker. Siana failed to appear as summoned. And there. Detloff was not making idle threats. Seems not. Need to make some serious plans of our own now. It's gone too far, damn it. Gotta find him. Stop him. Question is how. We've tried everything. That is not exactly true. There is a certain staggeringly dangerous, mind you, way to force Detlaf to reveal himself and incite him to fight. That's so. Go on then. Let me hear it. In due course. But first, Geralt, I'd like you to consider the alternative. After all, you could fulfill Detlaf's demand and liberate his beloved Siana. Okay, I don't think that, but let's think see what Detloff he thinks. Think Detlaf still believes Siana's innocent? I believe he suspects something. He must. And he seeks to understand what happened. And for that, he's declared war on the entire duchy? What can I say? Moderation was never his strong suit. Of course it was. Really want to free Siana? Hand her over to Detlaf? refuse to accept you consider that wise. It's hard to believe, I know. But Detlaf is not actually evil, merely impulsive. He needs but meet with her, speak with her, and he will spare the city. Mm. So say I agree to this, because I might. Still no chance on a Henrietta will. I do not recall ever suggesting we ask her permission. Okay, let's check it out. Sianna can't be harmed. The meeting. What if it's nothing like you say? What if it goes sour, ends in a fight? Willing to guarantee Sianna won't get hurt? It seems unlikely in the extreme. That... Didn't ask for a lecture on probability. Need a simple answer. Yes or no. I vow that not a hair on her head shall come to any harm. Okay, that's good. Got serious reservations about this plan. Not least among them, we have no idea where Siana's being held. You heard the Duchess. She's not at the prison. Hardly a reservation. More of an excuse. I'm certain you'll find her. You must merely decide you wish to. Hmm. Could ask Damien. Duchess treats him like a lapdog. Keeps him close most times. He might know something more. There, you see? I knew you'd think of something. Bravo. I trust I've dispelled your doubts, then. Not so fast. We're not done talking. How would I go about luring Detlaf out of hiding if I wanted to? With the blood of a virgin? You see, somewhere nearby lives an unusual denizen. One of the unseen, ancient and powerful vampires. Among the oldest and strongest. Mm-hmm, and? Tusa is this unseen elder's territory. All vampires owe him fealty while they are here. He need but say the word, designate a time and place, and Detlaf will be forced to appear. 
So this unseen elder, how do we convince him to summon Dedlaf? We must find him first. The elder does not see arrivals unless he absolutely must. But locals, Oriana, for instance, you know, she too is a... Yeah, I figured it out. All right, let's say she gets me in to see the Unseen Elder. What then? I don't know. You'll have to improvise, I suppose. Okay, so this elder is like a better vampire than Detlaf. That'll be interesting. Hmm. So I'm basically stuck. Either gotta give in to a blackmailer, or fight him. You know what I would opt for? Should we free Siana and arrange for her to meet with Detlaf? There's a good chance we'll all survive this ordeal. Detlaf included. Regis, don't mean to put you on the spot, but I gotta know. Say I do decide to fight Detlaf. Who'll you stand with? Should you decide your sword is the sole solution, I shall not stand in your way. Appreciate it. Certainly hope so. Now, please tell me, what is it you intend to do? Okay, I don't know yet, but um... Free Sienna and take the better Crazy highway, as the plan thing? seems, I'll do it. I'll ask Damien about Sienna. You won't make me beg. I knew you wouldn't. Slow down. Not promising a thing. Just want to get a feel for the situation to start with. Coming with? Of course. Many hands make light work. Damien could okay, be then let's dead. go and it's follow exactly. Regis. You seem battle hardened. More than a few scraps of Against humans, not monsters. Oh dear, we're gonna fight all of this stuff. Yeah, and I failed that quest because there was a bug. Thank yeah, you very much. Down I updated the game. Garkin, okay. How on earth do I beat this? What the hell is it with the sound effect? Jump out of the way, jump out. What the hell? Not today, bitch. Never thought lesser vampires would heed a higher vampire's call and commands. As a rule, they don't. So how did Lof sick them on the city? I told you, he's exceptional. He manages to bend them to his will, control them with his thoughts. They'll continue attacking until he orders them to back down, until he dies. He is exceptional, ain't he? Oh dear god. Oh, Brookster. I'm guessing. Yep. Another one? Uh, why are you trying to punch the vampire? Get the sword here! There we go. Double team! Just kick your ass. Kill the bitch. Don't you scream at me like that. Miserable kill. Come on. Come on. Regis, what are you doing, bud? And she's dead. Finally! Woohoo! Um, which way we're we going? This way, okay. Let me guess, more vampires. It's a ladder? No problem. Just as easy, bro. Need to look around. Need to look around, Armor okay. Proved useless. Claws sliced through steel like your butter. We must hurry. Each moment's delay means another death. They broke formation. Ran. That scent. It's Damien's blood. He was wounded. Let's go. How do you know that's his blood? Jeez, man. Okay then. See you later, dude. Eric, he put it in the street. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted to do, thank you. They didn't know. I didn't get a chance to prepare them. I'm going to scream it out now. How many vampires do I have to fight today? Okay, bring it. Come on. Do that screamy scream. 
There you go. And I wanna scream one more time. No? There you go. Oh what? I thought I thought I killed her. Well she definitely killed her this time. Is he getting his ass beat by a lesser vampire? Oh yeah, show me the moves, Regis. Oh dear. See? Stole his kill, but hey ho. We must focus on Damien. Time uh, okay, me. follow the blood. I suppose it is, whatever. Um, and all the way up here. You killed it! Single handedly! That harlot's brood slaughtered half my unit! I see the harlot's brood came close to slaughtering you as well. Need to withdraw. You and your men. Now. My duty lies with the city. Won't help the city by leading your men to the slaughter. Damien. Conversation back at the palace, remember? I'll say it again. Your men don't stand a chance. Men, tend to the wounded and prepare to march out. Doing the right thing. Now listen close. Silver, that's what you want to use against vampires. Your alchemists order them to produce as much vampire oil as they can, churn it out in gallons, then coat your blades with it. Keep an eye out for Alps and Bruxay. The shapely ones resemble women. They're one moment, gone the next. Bones containing silver splinters are a pretty good idea. Thank you, Witcher. I hope you're worth the coin the Duchess pledged you. And that you'll return with the head of the wretch that did this, skewered on a hook. Uh, leave it to me, yeah, let's just say Your that. Your problem's my problem now. Leave it to me, I'll solve it. How? All I can say just now is I'm gonna need Sienna. You know the Duchess's decision. Sianna awaits her trial, in custody. We know it, but we do not agree with it. You've that luxury. I do not. I've sworn my loyalty to her grace. Okay, folk are dying. Folk are dying. Many more will, because of one. If her grace learns I helped you, my head will roll. And ours will follow right after it. Yet still we are prepared to take the risk. I fear we waste our time here. Come, Geralt. Wait. When... When last I saw Sianna, her grace was escorting her to the palace playroom. Playroom? As in, for children? Are you sure? I've served in the Ducal Palace for years. I know it's every corner. So yes, I am damn sure. Playroom? So what, Duchess locked Sianna up in a dollhouse? Honestly, I've no clue. Look, I've told you what I saw. What you do with it is no concern of mine. Got it. I'll look into it. You get back to your barracks. Retrace my steps. Path ought to be clear. And you've our gratitude. You helped us a great deal. I helped Beauclair. At least I hope I did. Okay, let's -a go. Let's go, Regis. Oh, Jesus Christ, people. Come on. Why you do this? Yo, motherfucker. Bring it. And thank you for the mutagens and stuff. Locked. Of course. Regis. Rather not have a fist fight with his door. 
you mind. You just get inside. Like a pro. Thanks. At your service. Search the playroom. Creepy ass playroom if you ask me. Wooden duck. Somebody broke its wings off. Nice tune. Indeed. Pleasant. The rocking horse. Rather worn. I suppose it got a miniature tableware. And plush toys. Cute. Let's check this. Locked. Hmm. A journal. We found a journal. Okay. What the? Found a notebook. Property of Isabel de Roquefort, court governess. The notes of Siana and Anna Henrietta's governess when they were little. I'm not sure it will help, but I suppose there's no harm in leafing through them. Siana gave me a drawing today. Charming. Of freshly decapitated bodies covered in blood. Perhaps not so much. I asked her why ever she would draw such a thing. Her Highness claimed it was a rendering of nightmares which have plagued her for as long as she can remember. Siana does wake up screaming nearly every night, save when she shares a bed with Honorietta. Curse of the Black Sun. Supposedly girls afflicted by it had horrible dreams. Kind of horrible that made some of them go mad. The girls quarreled today. I must note rather sadly they did not behave as befits future ladies. The incident devolved into fisticuffs. Anna Henrietta was first to strike her sister. Siana gave back as good as she'd gotten. By the time I separated them, Anna Rieta had lost two teeth. She ran off to complain to her parents. His Grace the Duke refused to believe my version of events. He laid all the blame on Siana and vowed to punish the little one harshly. Anna Rieta did her best to have her sister's sentence commuted, but the Duke and Duchess proved unbending. Once you're labeled a black sheep, it's so hard to shed that reputation. Today I accompanied the girls for the first time to the land of a thousand fables. We spent half the day there. First we played with Thumbelina, then with Barbarossa, who proved quite the charmer for a brigand and pirate. I'm beginning to suspect Isabel de Roquefort wrote in her diary after taking a powerful hallucinogenic. Cannabis rudelaris, for instance, or... Shh, don't interrupt. I tip my cap to Master Artorius Figo for his achievement. He has proved he has no equal in the arcane arts. Wait, Artorius was the court mage here, a specialist in illusions, which means... Regis, last warning. Stop interrupting or I'll seat you in the corner. The girls told <laughs> me, if I ever wish to visit alone, I need but crack open the land of a thousand fables and utter out loud the incantation, Expecto Ludum. A book as the key to an illusion. My, my, this grows more interesting by the minute. Okay, let's check the other Major two and Sankar get out. The Conclave arrived today. They came to examine Siana. I cannot know what conclusions they drew, but His Grace now seems clearly upset. Mm. Curse of the Black Sun. There's no doubt then that she was diagnosed with the syndrome symptoms. Or had that label planted on her. It goes on. I dared ask the Duke what would become of the girl. He did not reply. I tutored the girls in Nilfgaardian today. Siana applies herself so, though she has great difficulty memorizing new vocabulary. Lady Honorietta seems more gifted in this regard, yet also prone to impish behavior. When she thought me out of earshot, she called me a blood accuser. She and Siana laughed so hard they almost choked. Hmm. Blood is damned, or cursed. What's accuser? In the melodious tongue of our non-too-friendly neighbors to the south, the word describes the many-petaled flower that blooms in that place we so unmelodiously call the crotch. Uh-huh, okay. What a good little girl. Mm, realize this might sound improbable, but maybe, just maybe, Anna Henrietta tossed Siana into that illusion. Not impossible. She would be safe there, and isolated. We must see. Well, okay, so we need to find the book. Where's that book? Come on. Get out of my way, Regis. Thank you. 
What behind here? Nothing under the carpet. Did you expect something? Apart from the dust swept under there by a lazy chambermaid. What about in here then? No, okay, never mind. Aha. Uh -huh. A tin knight. Pick it all up, because why not? Whoa. Well, picture. Well, a key tucked behind a picture. So I'm guessing the picture is for that. Oh, here. Unlocked, open, yay! Huh. Is it? Let's see. Say the words. Say the words. Expecto ludum. Regis? Regis? Land of a thousand fables. Incredible. Hmm. Let's see where this road takes me.